on YouTube. Just before I start this next video, uh, I want to first of all say a big thank you to all those of you who are YouTube customers. By this I mean people who see us on YouTube, who visit our website and, and um, commission solar projects. Uh, we value your trust deeply and uh, I just want to say a big heartfelt thank you for your continued business. So this next video is about one such uh, customer, but I also would like to point out the many things uh, that come as standard with our installations, uh, which are all on the website on a page we call the Colm Standard. So it's a standard that we try to uh, make sure we deliver for our clients, which is about a complete set of the very important uh, quality components uh, that all work together to make sure your solar installation works efficiently and is bulletproof. So we're talking anything from uh, roof to ground lighting conductors, type 1 surge protectors, type 2 surge protectors both AC and DC, type 3 surge protectors, fridge timers, battery desulfators, thick cables, 50 millimeter battery cables, uh, string isolation, DC box, AC box. You know, there's so many things uh, in your installation. It's not just about grade A quality solar panels. So in this next video, I try as much as possible to show you some of these components, and I'm going to be doing that going forward so that when we talk about solar installations you know that you know we need to be comparing like with like the handful of good solar outfits out there in Lagos southwest Nigeria uh, just a handful uh, my very good friend Chris Omosaya of Atlantic is one of them he's a good, they're good the good people uh, hello Chris <laughs> long time um, and some other uh, good outfits, energy, and you know. But don't compare the kind of solar installations you're going to be getting from these kinds of uh, solar companies, reputable solar companies, with any old electrician that doesn't have a clue who's just going to buy you some, you know, and tie together and say you have a solar, you know. So please uh, watch the video and enjoy. Uh, okay. Enjoy. So here uh, we have installed 4 kilowatts of top quality grade A polycrystalline uh, solar panels, 265s. Uh, we have used the roof space efficiently so there's ample space for future expansion. And as you can see we're using genuine UV listed solar uh, cabling. Another four kilowatt installation up on the roof in the same date, and you can see here mm. this is a smaller powerhouse with 600 amp hour battery bank. And as you see, you can tell it's our installation, it looks like our installation, you can tell because now we know where we go. Again, you can see that there fire alarm, that's uh, a smoke uh, detector. Sorry there and uh, it's all done properly we're getting 109 volts 685 watts Six ninety five watts, fourteen amps from the sun, and this is still early in the morning. Batteries are at forty eight point eight. You can see 
obviously box there, it's all properly nice. Obviously there's no means electricity at this point. There's no means electricity. But that's all. Four screens, one kilowatt each. You see that? Beautifully done. You can see our surge protection cables, earth cables. Earth, where's the earth here? Yeah, you can see the earth cable in the back there. Earth cabling in there, if you can see the green. But yeah, it's all properly earthed. All done nicely. So this is LED lights, yeah? Mm. Yeah. yeah. It's a very nice installation. Mm. You can see our disulfator there. Can you get me the light? Show them the disulfator. That's the battery breaker. There. That is a outback 100 amp battery breaker, which we are installing as standard or uh, midnight solar. One of the two. So we are just under one kilowatt from the sun, 110 volts, 19, 18, 19 amps, batteries are 49, and it's just 10 30 a.m. in the morning. Z1 So beautiful. This homeowner just told us that he slept off grid with one air conditioner on and he woke up at 48 volts. So not bad. Not bad at all. This is the other thing here. You can see our mains three phase SPD there. Okay. Three Three live and one neutral going there and then one earth coming out to that box. You can see all our 16 mm earth cabling and then going down into the ground there. So all our installations now have that surge protection device uh, at the mains, at the first point of port. First port of call, and then the type. What we can see on type two protection there for the AC side, and in here, uh, for, you can see our type two there for the AC side, and there for the DC side. Type three protectors are obviously inside the house with no extension cords, and then there is a. a Lightning to ground conductor on the floor, mounted directly on the roof. So, uh, 50 mm cables, you see. So, when we tell people you got to do solar properly, they say, Ah, what is it? Well, you can see all the components that's a 60 amp MPPT there, 15 kVA, AVR, that's 15 kVA, you can see. 15 kVA. Not 10. Well done, boys. Well done. Thanks. Good installation. Well done, Matthew. And up there, you can see the roof to ground lighting conductor. Up there. There it is. Going all the way down. Okay. SPD, you can see the sign, the symbol there. It's a surge protection device. You can 
can see that surge okay always look out for that sign that is your type 3 SPD it's a power strip with that sign um, and buy good quality ones to protect all your electronic equipment like connected here okay so we're going to the next one 